Hi, I'm Andrew with Baker's Gas. We're here today with 3M's G5-01 Papper system. So, we uh, what I'm going to do in this video, we're going to go over the features of this unit and how it works, functionality. We'll put it on, show everything going on. But let's try it, tear right into it. So the bag it comes with, awesome bag, very durable, very nice. You can see helmet in there, and then we get all the accessories in here. We got our two that goes from the back of the hood down. We got a belt that goes around that holds the actual papper system around the back. This one has the straps for a backpack so you can strap to the belt so it kind of takes the weight off your hips. Pretty nice. And then inside there, we got our blower motor. So this system now, if, if anyone's remember, familiar with the 9100 FX series papper system, New hood, same blower motor. So options out there, but these are, you know, the same. It's going to be the same, similar blower, blower and everything, but new hood and new features on that. We got some batteries in there. So let's set this off to the side here. Just like can into it. So the the unit I got on demo here is a what they call it, and it's new to the G501. It's called a variable color. So this is the VC model. They make a regular model, right? But the VC model changes the color of what you see when you're welding, right? So if you want a traditional green style shade, there's a green button. If you want the new crisp blue, there's a blue button. And if you want a red shade, there's a red, red shaded when you're art, when you're welding. Uh, the variable color goes from it goes up to a shade 14. The other one goes to a shade 13. So this does a little bit higher shade, but. All in all, the helmet is very nice. I mean, in 3M quality is top notch. I, I will tell you, if people are looking into Pappers, um, 3M probably and is one of the best best ones out there on the market. Just because of durability, um, they hold up over a long period of time. Uh, I know a lot of people that are just that have been using speed glasses for many years, and uh, they're they're great. So on this G501 Papper here, we got the one with the flip up with the grind shield on it that's an awesome system too because then you don't have to take that hood off every time you gotta look outside you know get out of your welding hood and then that thing just flips back down standard lenses that fit the the old style stuff so that's a thing these are all um we have them all we'll list them all down below but those are all interchangeable the inner lenses are interchangeable uh, there are some different options on these as well. You can get a baklava that comes down further. You can get a, a neck garter that comes down further. Um, just some different things that you can do. You can get covered hose or just your standard hose, but pretty simple. So let me tear open and get the blower motor going. So basically on our blower here, we just get pops open like the old style. Got our, our little motor right there, and then it has the filter which we stock as well. Um, but this all comes out NIOSH approved. Right? And it's got a pre-filter and then it has a screen inside that knocks down all the hard particulates before it hits your pre-filter um, and then gets to your regular filter. So very, very nice setup. Everything is clean, neat. Um, that's what I like about 3M product, man, and it, and it works. Um, so the battery, a lot, of, a lot of questions on the battery. Um, typically eight to 10 hour runtime. Uh, very nice on off button. So when you, when you, it's behind your back, you can feel it. It's, it's depressed and raised on the on and depressed on the off. Um, kind of, it's hard to see, but it's, it's pretty nice. You can feel it. Um, and then, but all, all in all the battery. Now, let's tear into that here. Everyone asks, you know, should I buy two batteries? Should I buy extra batteries? To be honest with you, I, I, you, you could, um, but the battery life on these these new ones is, is very good. So, I mean, I would wait until that battery is near its ending its life. There's the charger, just 110 plugs into the end. There. So you get all this in the Papper system, and then you also get the battery. So. Pretty nice serial number on the back if you ever have any warranty issues. 3M backs these things very, very well. Never had any trouble with any warranty from 3M. Uh, but this is a lithium ion. The older versions were a NICAD and they were much heavier if anybody remembers having those. Another thing about this, it just, it just snaps in there and then you can charge it while it's on the blower. 
So that's that's pretty cool. You got a little cut out port right there. And then your belt just loops through here and then everything straps on there. So give me a second, I'll get I'll get everything suited up and we'll try it on. All right, so I got the battery snapped in. We got the blower motor on my side here through its belt. Um, so as you see, kind of I got it off to the side, but it goes around my back. So we turn it on, comes on one speed, and it's got a filter uh, gauge, right? So one light is good. If we get all the way to here, that means our filter is clogging up. It's got a battery level gauge as well. We're on one light there. Um, but yeah, let's, I'll show you how to snap everything in. So it's easier if I get to break the hood. I think it's easier if we go like that and then take it and it just goes in one way and then it twists. So pretty simple. Take the hood off here. So basically I guess slide this belt on. You want that on your back shoulder like that and just kind of you can see it doesn't really get kinked up either it just drapes on there and we'll pull this all down. So a lot of a lot of air movement you can see very nice. You can see on the side I got air duct gauges too and you can control which way the air is coming in the hood. It's pretty nice, but let me, uh, I'll pop this off and I'll pop out the lens here and show you it. So, you can control the, so visor or face, so you can control whether it's blown on your face or on your, on your head there. It's very nice. It's got that nice locking system like the G502 as well. Slim, you can get in the tight spots. Um, all this comes out and it's all washable so you can wash all of that they got you know replacement headliners as well um, but it's pretty nice how you can adjust that airflow um, and I, I mean it's it's drastic how how it changes and some people you know they liked it on their face some people liked it on their head so they just came out with like that and it gave it a good you know it's, a, it's something new and I'll shut this off here and then what I'll do is I'll pull that lens out and I'll show you how the variable color. So that lens will show that. Pull that off. Two tabs up top. Pulls the whole lens out. And there's that. So not you don't have to do that to adjust it every time. But I'm just going to show you here for this. On the we got our shade change, and we got we're on shade 11. Nice big buttons. Um, goes up to a 14 like I said and then we got a B or C so that that's what changes your color display so people are familiar with some other com competition some of the older style stuff that was just a straight green lens now we can change it green blue or red this thing Bluetooth links to your phone as well so you can also change this stuff on your phone th via the app through uh, uh, 3M, so pretty awesome. I don't know if you ever watched my G502 video, but I got it linked to my phone. I can change all my shade, and then we can obviously go down to cut, which is a shade five. And then you got your sensitivity and your delay. So how how high and low on the sensitivity, short and long on the on the delay. I just got it in the middle of the road. Um, there again, serial number right there for warranty stuff. But like I said, most of these are pretty long lasting hoods. But that variable color button is uh, what changes your shade color. So kind of, it's very unique to this, this particular model. Like I said, they make the other, uh, the same unit, but without that as well. But let me snap that back in there. So, and I was showing, I should just go right back in, snaps in there, and then our lens cover just goes on there. They're again, all replaceable too, if those get burned up, melted. We'll link all that stuff down below. All in all, what I like about the hood, um, it's 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 got a little bit of weight to it, but for the papper and for that lens, man, the clarity on it is awesome. Um, I welded with one in a fab shop, and 
it is pretty cool to change the color. Not that that's a big thing. Most people just like one straight color, but blue was my favorite, but it was, it was still cool that you could do it, right? You could change that a little bit. And I like the, the grinding shield. So you don't have to keep flipping down. And like I said before, 3M makes a product that is, is made to stand up to a lot of stuff. So these things are, are very durable. Um, while they're not the cheapest in the game, they probably are one of the best in the game. And that's what 3M is going to stand there, stand their ground on is that, hey, we make a product that's going to last a long time. Um, and it does. These are really nice. So if you've got any questions or comments, please leave them down below. We'll do our best to answer them. Thanks again for watching and stay tuned for some more.